today I'll be making tiger's eye soap. So we're first starting with mixing the lye water into our oils. Then we will separate our batter into our colors. First we have a yellow, then a brown, an orange, and then our main bucket here is going to be a, a secondary yellow. Uh, we're going for a little bit more of a paler yellow in the uh, bucket. So then I'm just simply mixing all of the colors in, making sure that they're properly combined. I did find that my uh, lighter yellow wasn't quite light enough, and so I'm just going to adjust that by brightening the darker yellow. And then I'm going to lighten with titanium dioxide um, the lighter yellow. Mine is water soluble so I just add a little bit of water and mix it and then combine it with the uh, soap batter. I've added my fragrance and now I'm ready to pour. This is an in-the-pot technique, um, but I'm not pouring them in specific spots. I'm just um, mixing them kind of in, in the pot as if I was to put little um, spots in and then use a spatula to kind of stir it lightly. I'm just doing that myself um, by stirring the, um, the container as I'm pouring. Now I'm going to pour it into the mold. So as you can see, I didn't have to stir it with a spoon, it stirred itself. I've gone ahead and textured the top and now I mixed some uh, carrier oil with some mica and I'm just putting a few drops and this is completely um, personal, whatever uh, you know you feel will look nice. I'm just using the same colors that I used inside of the soap um, to kind of bring out some different colors instead of it just being more orange, yellow on the top. I'll now add a little bit of yellow on the same side as the orange. And we'll now uh, drag, I guess, the um, the mica to kind of paint the top of the soap. I'll now add the stones. So these are um, tiger eye stones. I really need to uh, mark my darker molds with my little lines because it makes it a little bit harder when you're not too sure. I'm just showing you the, the effect that the stone has. It's pretty remarkable actually. Now I'm going to add some colored um, salt. So I just uh, did a few spritz of rubbing alcohol, added some gold mica, and stirred them together. So I did a, um, a thicker, I guess, um, coarser salt, that's the word, and then a less coarse salt on the opposite side just to give it some definition. And there you have it. And here is the soap, all cut and clean. As you can see, it has the 
uh, brown swirls the orange the lighter yellow the darker yellow uh, it kind of resembles a little bit of those tiger stripes that you'd see um, you know when you think of a tiger eye I kind of think of a regular tiger so I wanted to um, use those colors and and try and make some very wispy soft uh, stripey type lines. You almost see um, a face in there, the two eyes and the nose and the mouth. It's, it's pretty cool when you start to cut your soap and see different things in there.